Hi friends, Radhika Ravikumaya. So in this tutorial, we'll uh, we'll just uh, uh, continue with the Informatica, the simple mapping creation. So in the previous uh, tutorials, I've already uh, told you how we can make use of the expression in order to concatenate the first and last name and all. So now uh, let us mm, do some more operations on expression uh, based on age, gender, and all, and also employee number. So now just double click on the employee number and in the pro uh, in the port sorry just uh, create a new port here uh, below the employee id and give a name as uh, o underscore employee number my requirement is now if the employee number em employee id is uh, null then i need to specify some number like uh, i need to say 999 if it is um, it is having number it's not null then i just need to pass the employee id directly okay that's what my requirement is so let me uh, uncheck this o uh, output port let me um, uncheck this also this, this is going to be an output port o underscore employee number now here click on the double sorry uh, double arrow mark and here what i'm going to give the condition is like this is the condition if you need to say iif okay uh, then here i'm going to check is null of just go to ports is null of i'm going to check the employee id so just say is null of employee id then you need to do something or else you need to do something it's like an um, if condition like uh, i'm i'm just saying in inside the if i'm just checking whether is null of employee id if this is true then say 9999 okay four nines or else comma just pass the employee ID itself. So uh, you can you can see uh, here th if this is true, then comma this nine 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 will go. Or or else if this is false, it is not null. Then directly the employee. This is just if it is true, this value. If it is false, then this value. So this is how the this um, if condition will work. Just uh, validate here and say okay. So now our uh, employee ID port uh, condition is over. Now let us go a little bit more uh, further and uh, check if we have a port called gender. Yeah, in gender, uh, what I need to do is, first of all, uh, I'm really sorry, I need to make this um, uh, data type to integer because it's an employee ID. So it's done now. Okay. Now let us go to the gender. Here again, create another port called uh, o underscore gender. So my flat file is having gender uh, as something like uh, F, M, it's just in one letter. Now by loading, I wanted to convert it into, if it is F, gender is F, then I want to specify it as female in my table. If it is M, I need to specify it as male. If it is like no, nothing is there, then I just need to specify as null. So that's what my requirement is. For that sake, uh, I have created a new port called O underscore gender. Okay let uh, this be something like uh, 10 is fine uh, i'll make this as output port and i'll make this gender as an input port and now let us let us go and uh, create the formula so here uh, in the same way how we did it for the employee id same way just say if okay just go to ports and um, we'll have this gender double click on it gender gender is, is equal to uh, f then i need to specify female okay so if this is this condition is true then this one if this condition fails then what i need to do is i need to uh, create another uh, one if inside this just say if iif then i'm going to say here again just gender equal to m then say male or else say null so validate it's okay 
so hope you have understood this what i have done is inside an if condition i have created another uh, nested if what i am doing here is just say if gender is equal to fe f then i need it to be i need it to specify as female if this is true then female or else if this is not true then go to this if if condition he again here i am checking whether if gender is equal to m if this is true then male if these both condition doesn't pass then say null that's what i've mentioned here you can see i've um, separated by commas here home hope uh, you have understood this now just validate it and say okay and our um, gender port is also ready now let us uh, go to age and uh, create it in the same way so we'll see this in uh, next tutorial how we can uh, create for age also so till then uh, just apply it here apply say apply and okay so we'll meet in next tutorial then thank you very much for watching